The world continues to evolve and as a result, so do the needs of the environment in which we live. It is important to keep on developing your professional skills in order to adapt to these changes and make a difference. The University of Pretoria's Faculty of Veterinary Science offers postgraduate opportunities that are geared towards learning new skills and more importantly, introducing the student to academic debates and the impact of evidence-based decision-making to provide sustainable and innovative solutions for the future. Our postgraduate programs offer a wide range of options that reveal more than just one approach to veterinary science. It's about ensuring the sustainability of our planet's creatures, regardless of their size or species, and making a positive contribution toward the future of our environment. We view all knowledge generated through our research initiatives as the cornerstone to sustainable development in our country's economy and as a way to contribute to a globalized society, especially one built on international trade policies. Through high quality, impactful research, our students develop critical thinking expertise and effective analytical research and communication skills that are globally sought after. We stay ahead of the fourth industrial revolution, combining technological advancement with sustainability and the protection of species across the African continent. This in turn has placed much focus on research that matters. The core of our research efforts incorporates, but is not limited to, translational medicine, African wildlife health and management, pathobiology of disease, sustainable livelihoods and well-being, where specific emphasis is placed on a wide variety of focus areas. These research areas present excellent foundations for masters and PhD candidates to contribute to research that is not only locally relevant, but provides the impetus for achieving global sustainable development goals. Our master's degree in veterinary medicine also provides you with the ability to specialize in close to 20 fields and species. The variety of postgraduate diplomas means that students with a passion for animals can continue developing specific areas of competence in veterinary professions through transdisciplinary research. So choose UP and apply for a postgraduate program at our Faculty of Veterinary Science to ensure that you're ahead of the curve as a leader with innovative solutions to global challenges. Good afternoon. Welcome back. I hope you all enjoyed our new faculty video, uh, which is dedicated to our postgrad studies. As you would have seen from the video, the faculty is moving forward in very innovative research. And this is just a showcase of what is to come. As you would have seen today, the faculty is involved in a number of innovative projects. And this is something we hope we will be able to showcase in future and from time to come. Now, moving on in the day. Now, to commemorate the event, we decided to put together a centenary book. Through the efforts of the staff in the Dean's office, being Francie Lottring, Paul Van Damme, Miranda Oersthuizen, Renee Abinetti, Mari watson Crick, Chris Van Black, and myself, we have collated 100 years of history into a coffee table book to allow for a pictorial remembrance of a centenary. While this book will not be sold, we will make available a link to the electronic version on the faculty website, hopefully by tomorrow. It now gives me great pleasure to award two of these books. The first book will be awarded to Prof. Coupe for his personal collection. Thank you. I would also like to hand over a second copy to the library. I would invite Lindy Ware, our Director of Library Services across, to receive a copy specifically for the Hatfield Library. Thank you. As a further step in remembrance, the faculty also made a request to the Minister of Communications and Digital Technologies to develop a centenary stamp. We are very fortunate to be granted this permission in 2020. The faculty then took the decision not just to have one stamp, but to have five different stamps to match each of our five departments. To select these pictures, the faculty held a competition which was adjudicated by a stamp advisory committee. 
The advisory committee then engaged with the South African Post Office to manage this process. While we can't share the actual stamp because its development was delayed for COVID or due to COVID and does rem thus remains confidential, we are able today to announce the five winning pictures, which will now be displayed together with the names of the photographer. Congratulations to the winners. I hope you enjoy the fact that your pictures will be remembered as part of our centenary. The pictures will be shown now. Thank you.